Benzene is a wonderful compound. Being one of the most stable compounds, it rarely bonds with anything. The reason for its stable bond is due to its three double bonds with six hydrogen atoms in a cyclical formation. But with a catalyst, it becomes possible to break these bonds. Bromobenzene is one such compound which is created from the breakage of benzene atoms. This is only possible through the use of a catalyst, benzene molecule and a bromine molecule. And so, in today's video, I'll be informing you on the amazing compound that is bromobenzene. To start with, the IUPAC name for this compound is simply bromobenzene. The molecule has no other name. The reaction of bromobenzene occurs through a substitution reaction using a catalyst. The catalyst in this case being iron powder. A hydrogen with a benzene atom is taken off and replaced with a positively charged bromine atom, leaving bromobenzene and a hydrogen bromide compound. The chemical formula for this compound is C6H5Br, meaning it consists of 6 carbons, 5 hydrogens, and 1 bromine atom. Furthermore, this compound is a clear to slightly yellowish liquid with a pungent odor. The boiling point for this compound is 156 degrees Celsius along with its melting point being negative 30.8 Celsius. So what is bromobenzene used for exactly? Well, for a variety of things in fact. Additive to motor oils and as a crystallizing solvent. The reason bromobenzene can be used for these is such things is because of its unique structure which makes it insoluble in water and also makes it denser than water. The structures of hydrogen bonding allow for the reaction between oils to help compounds such as motor oil. On top of this, how does bromobenzene play with the environment? Well, not very well. If spilled and not dealt with, bromobenzene can become flammable, releasing toxins. Exposure from this compound can have serious impacts on human life. The compound is known for being harmful if swallowed, inhaled, or absorbed through the skin, can affect the liver system if inhaled, and may also damage the nervous system and also cause irritation to the skin and throat. And as far as an alternative is concerned for this compound, it seems unclear at the moment. So, the next time you think about putting motor oil in your car, just know, thousands of complicated bonds are used to get your car moving. Most important of all, the compound bromobenzene. Thank you for watching my video presentation on bromobenzene and have a nice day.